Good morning. In this video, you're going to learn how to add a splash of branding to your Unreal Engine project by adding a custom splash screen that loads when you open up the project. All right, so I have this project here, right? So if I open this up, we will have the normal uh, Unreal splash screen here. So what I'm going to show you today is how we can replace this with our own custom one. So first we need an image. So I'm going to do a print screen of my cinematic here. Find a suitable angle. I like this one. Then I'm going to do Shift Windows S. Drag out a box here of my selection to do a print screen of just this area. So let's create a new image. And this image is going to be 720 by 1368. We have to take into consideration some graphics that are going to appear on the splash screen. So the easiest way to avoid it is to go into view and then guides, new guide layout and do 11 rows and create a box for the bottom two, one, uh, two rows here, uh, which will be reserved to some graphics for Unreal. Then we can go ahead and clear this guide. Then we're going to paste in our image and then let's design something nice here. Then I'm going to add a title or a title card. It's great. And then I'm also going to add some branding. And I would avoid the uh, lower left because that's where the graphics are going to appear. So I would instead suggest uh, if you're going to add graphics, add them to the right. So it's time to save. And when you save, it's very important that you save it as a BMP and name it Ed Splash. This combination is important for Unreal to find it. If you don't have Photoshop or you're doing it in another software, I would recommend converting a PNG or a JPEG using convert.io.co. I'm not affiliated to the site in any way, but I do use it a lot because it's very easy to just convert files here for free, of course. Next up, we need to find our content folder of our project. So the easiest way is probably just to go into the project and then right click on any asset in the asset browser and then show in Explorer. Here we're going to right click and create a new folder called Splash. And in this folder, we're going to create our new BMP image and then paste it in the Splash folder. Unreal will prompt you that it has found a new asset, so let's just import it. And then it's time to restart the engine. When you now fire up your project again, you will see your new splash screen appear instead of the original uh, one from Unreal Engine. I hope you found the video helpful. And if you like this video, perhaps you're interested in one of these other two videos that I made. Thank you so much for watching and goodbye.